The north coast of County Antrim is one of the world's beauty spots, with its towering cliffs, many prehistory sites, castles and bird riggeries, it attracts many thousands of visitors each year. Carrigarade Bridge is a challenge for many people to cross. Uh, all the world loves a ham. Now it is a long way down, but it doesn't count unless you actually fall. And leaving aside the dog, it is reputed that no one has fallen since the new ropes were installed. Geraldine lost her sense of balance years ago and has no trouble. And my big sister, well, she thinks it's a dawdle. Close by is Port Braddon. It is a beautiful village consisting only of a few houses located at the bottom of a large cliff in a sheltered cove. One of its claim to fame is St. Gobham's Church, the smallest in Ireland, at about 8 by 4 feet. It was listed on the National Register for a while until someone looked into its past and it was discovered it was built as a cow shed in the 1950s. It was quietly delisted. Dunluce Castle was built in 1500s by the McCullens and has a very checkered history including sieges and battles for possession of the castle. It was even owned at one stage by Winston Churchill. It really doesn't take much imagination to see it as it may have been in its heyday. At one time it hosted an annual fair, but this was closed down due to excessive bawdiness and debauchery. Spoiled sports everywhere. If you get the chance to visit the north coast of Antrim, do so, you won't regret it. Make sure to bring a rain jacket. Yeah.